Hey, baby. Now nah, he's locked up. Do you know what time it is? I, I, I fell asleep in the lot. Oh. Fell asleep in the lot? Well, you never use your head. Oh. Pony boy, where have you been? You have two brothers here worried sick about you and you fall asleep in the lot? Hey, there, calm down. Shut man. up! Don't talk to Soda like that. I didn't mean to! Breaking news. 17-year-old Robert Shelton stab was stabbed in front of, the, of a fountain. We have an on-the-spot report with Eddie Kwan now. Eddie? Thank you, Loki. I'm here. I'm Eddie, and I'm here on the spot at, um, uh, um, uh, at the fountain. Uh, where the murder was committed of, um, um, what's his name? I think, I think his name was Bob. Uh, of Daniel. No, Bob. Oh, uh, uh, Bob. At last night at around, uh, um, um, around midnight, I think. Oh, by the way. Sometime last night, and as you can see, there's been a lot of blood leakage, and we're here with his mom and his parents at this moment. And let's turn over to his parents. Go. I'm here with Bob's parents at this time, and you, being Bob's closest living people, how do you feel about his death? Yeah, I'm Bob's mom. He was he was always a good kid growing up, you know. So he might have his bad times, but he was always getting... Good, good grades in his classes, and he, he was always top athlete at his school. I should have never let him out that day. I just can't believe he's gone. And you, Bob Zat, how do you feel? I can't believe he's dead. Whoever killed him, I gotta kill him too. Ah! And who may you be? I, I'm Cherry Valence, Bob's second late, late girlfriend. And I just can't believe he's dead. Sometimes he can be rude, really abusive, a jerk, <laughs> but, you know, he can be sweet sometimes, and, you know, he's dead, you know. <laughs> and there you have it, folks, the testimony of the sweet love of the parents and of his late girlfriend. And here's some footage that we managed to catch on the security cameras around the park. Now the next picture we're going to show you is so bloody, so gory, that any of you with weak bladders or stomach, please, please, step out of the room or go to the bathroom now. Here our photographers have captured a picture of Robert Sheldon, age 17, stabbed last night. Now back to the studio. Thank you, Eddie. We are mourning over Robert Sheldon's death. Our hearts are with his family. If any information on the suspects, Johnny and Ponyboy, please call 777-7777 or 911. Thank you. Now on to our next story, local puppy hero or villain.